What's up gamers, we're the Skyblock Scrubs, and today we're going to be showcasing this bad boy, the Golden Dragon Pet. Uh, we're going to tell you a little bit about how to get it, but mainly we're going to be doing a damage test. So, if you want to see how drastic of a difference it makes, then uh, just watch till the end. Alright boys, so a lot of people might uh, look up Golden Dragon on the AH who are saving up for it. And they're like, alright, well the lowest level 200 is... It looks like 1.15 billion coins. And they're like, all right, that's a lot. I think I can get it. Actually, it's a lot more expensive than that. Uh, so basically, there's a bunch of prerequisites you need. And some of you may know this, so you can just skip for it if you already do. All right, guys. So basically, the first thing you need is you got to go to your museum. And you got to put something in there worth 500 mil. Because you need 500 mil in your museum to even unlock the bank upgrade. And then once you have 500 mil in there, you can go over to, I don't know what her name is, the hot skyblock character in the uh, red dress. You go over to her and you pay her 10 mil to unlock bank upgrades. Then you go to Bazaar and you buy the gold blocks you need and you have like 75 mil in your purse. And then you upgrade your bank to the one bill. So just that alone, that's like a frick ton of money. Um, and then after that, you need a mill gold collection to even unlock the banks. Then you have a one bill bank capacity. Then you get a billion coins and you put it in the bank because G Drag without a bill in your bank, will, as we'll show you later, is uh, kind of kind of free, literally freer than King Super's tacos. Um, so you have a bill in your bank and then you buy the G Drag. So it's it's quite expensive. I mean, you need at least a three bill net worth to even be in the ballpark of having a G Drag. So have fun with that one, Chief. Alright boys, here's the setup he's using, by the way. The reason we're testing this outside of dungeons is because my term has Soul Eater. Obviously I'm testing with term because I'm not mailing with a hype because I'm not a dumb dumb. So, I'm, the term has Soul Eater though and that fricks up inside of dungeons because every single mob has different strengths. So we're testing it out here, it's more reliable. Alright, so the first test we're doing is no G-Drag at all. All right, we got a crit. All right, 263K, 264. Yeah, around 260K. Now we equip G-Drag, but keep in mind, right now I have zero coins in the bank, so none of the coin bonuses work. And 309K, 309K. See, if you don't have coins in your bank, G-Drag is legit worthless. All right now, I'm going to deposit one bill into the bank. Flex, there we go. All right, now this, watch this damage, this is insane. 443k, 382k, 443k. Like, just think about that. Like, it went from 260 to 440k, and that's just the pet. So, I mean, G Drag is absolutely cracked. It's insanely expensive, but that is the full power of a G Drag. It almost doubles my damage, so, um, pretty cracked. Alright, boys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you know a little bit more about how much damage the G-Drag is and how much it's worth so you can kind of determine if you want to buy it or not. Um, I would say buy it. If you have enough money, like almost, then I mean, what else are, are you going to use the money on, you know? You're going to be so rich at that point that you may as well go for it. That's like, uh, otherwise you would be spending like 200 mil on like sharpness 3 and upgrade your damage by like 0.01%. So. I would recommend going for it if you have the money, obviously. And uh, yeah, we stream every Friday and Saturday at 9.30 p.m. Mountain Time, and we also stream occasionally during the week at also at 9.30 p.m. Mountain Time. We also stream um, every Monday at 3.12 a.m. Mountain Time, so be sure to be there. You better wake up, send the alarm for that time, but we will definitely be streaming. Yep, Yeah. no caparoonies. And we stream until 8 a.m. on Mondays. So you might be late for your first couple of classes to school, but it'll be worth it, trust me.